Hey everyone, today we're taking you on to the ultimate status matching tour around Atlantic City. So if you watch all of our travel adventures, you know how much we love our perks and benefits from all our hotel statuses. So today we're going to stretch our hotel statuses a little further by matching them into casino statuses. But Bernard, you might be asking me, I don't gamble, so what's the point getting casino statuses? Now that's where you might be wrong, because there are a lot of partnerships between hotels and casinos, and with casino statuses, you can get a lot of lucrative benefits such as free hotel stays, free play, free parking, and most importantly, wave resort fees. And if you stayed in Las Vegas before, you would know how much these resort fees cost you in a day easily $40 a night and for a week you can save hundreds of dollars. So that's why we're doing this status matching tour today in Atlantic City. Hey everyone, we finally made it. We are in Atlantic, Atlantic City. City. So what are we doing today, B? We're gonna do status match. <laughs> what is status match? Uh, status match with casinos and then get a whole bunch of free stuff and see how much free stuff we can get out of it. So that's how we're in Atlantic City today because we're gonna try this little thing that B has researched and kind of quasi set up. And hopefully we get a lot of free stuff and it all works out. Yeah, let's go. So how do we start? First off, you need to get a high level player's casinos card. But how do we get that? So there are three options. The very first option is sign up for a founder's card, which is kind of like a membership club situation where you submit a quote and it might cost you $400 or $600 in a year. But this card itself will get you instant Caesars Diamond status. So with that, you already have a high level player's casinos card. For the next two options, you need to first get status with two current hotels, Wyndham Diamond or Hyatt Explorers. So traditionally, if you want to get these two hotel status, for Wingham Diamond, you need to stay 24 nights at Wingham Hotels. And for Hyatt Explorers, you need to stay at least 30 nights at Hyatt Hotels. But don't worry, if you don't want to stay 24 nights at Wingham Hotel, all you need to do is sign up for a business earner card with Barclays. It comes with an annual fee, and you don't really need a business to sign up for a card, but you just need to fill in the necessary paperwork. And with this card itself, you will get instant Wingham Diamond status. And with Wingdom Diamond status, all you need to do is go online and match it into Caesars Diamond because they have a partnership. And then you already have one of the higher status of player's card in the casino. As for the third option, if you can't really stay 30 nights at Hyatt's, which are really pricey, there's currently a promotion with Hyatt. All you need to do is call this number and ask them to register you for a status challenge or a status match challenge. And all you need to do is stay 10 nights instead of 30 to earn Hyatt Explorer status. And once you attain Hyatt Explorer status, you need to go online and match it to MGM Gold. So once you have any of these two high level players casinos card, which is Caesars Diamond or MGM Gold, you can start off your status matching tour. Our recommendation if you want to do it all, is starting from Wingdom Diamond status into Caesars Diamond status and do the status match online and then go into a physical casino which is Haraz, Caesars, or Tropicana. But personally, I would pick Haraz because it's right next door to Bogata and it's closer enough in proximity to do the status matching. Vice versa, if you have MGM Gold status, you can get it matched into Caesars Diamond status, skipping the entire step with Wingdom Diamond. Or you can use Caesars Diamond matching into Wingdom Diamond. All right, so we just got out from Haraz and we physically got our Caesars Diamond player's card printed. So just to go through the benefits of what comes with this card, you get $100 dining credits for free at any participating restaurant in all Caesars property and resorts. That's really nice. Number two, you get two free shows every month if you visit Las Vegas and you can collect them from the player's desk. Last but not least, you obviously get all the freebies like promotions, discounts on stays, wave resort fees, 
and free parking when you stay at Caesars property. So pro tip, make sure when you print your player's card, always ask them for expiration date on your player's card. Some staff at the player's desk are sticklers about rules because they want to make sure that you have an expiration date on your player's card before they match you into their player's card status. So that's our very first pro tip, making sure you have your expiration date on your player's card. All right, so let's head to our next stop to match this to MGM Gold at Borgata, which we are walking to right now. MGM Gold card and we can start our status matching tour with this very first high level casino player status. So traditionally if you are a new player and you're matched to MGM Gold, you will get $100 free play as a new player and one free calm night at the Bogada itself which is a really nice casino and resort. As well as getting a free pass into the lounge which is the Emporia lounge which is really nice, getting free flow of food and open bar. As of 2022, they remove all of these fun perks and you don't get any more of the fun stuff. But still, with MGM Gold, you get wave resort fees which can save you a ton of money if you visit Las Vegas and stay for, let's say, a week. And you get free parking. If you're also doing your research, you might ask that if they give you the $100 dining credit, Unfortunately, that's only for people who actually gamble and earn the gold status, so you don't really get a $100 dining credit. Alright, so with our MGM Gold card, we're gonna head to our next stop, which is the Hard Rock at Atlantic City, to do our next status match. Another pro tip when you and your partner or spouse are traveling together. You can link up your partner's MGM account and share your gold status right after you match and receive your gold card, which means you and your partner can double up on all of the status matching with your MGM gold card and double dip on all of the fun perks that we're going to walk you through in this video. Just make sure you and your partner also print the MGM gold card from the rewards desk before you leave. All right, so we're at our next status match location, which is the Hard Rock at Atlantic City. So now we got our MGM Go, and we're gonna go to the rewards desk and see what status match can this get us. After getting our Hard Rock Rock Royalty card, as new players, we were each given two free nights at the resort. But we could only redeem the stay 72 hours after our sign up. And each of us were given $50 free play which we both turned into $70 profit in cash after a few hours of slots entertainment. And now, with our newly minted Rock Royalty cards, we're off to our next stop, the Ocean Casino. Alright, so our next pit stop of our status matching tour around Atlantic City is Ocean's Casino. Ocean's a little bit far, it's in the north side of Atlantic City, and we're taking, once again, our Hard Rock Rock Royalty card to the Players Club and status match and hopefully get more fun stuff. Let's go. and we just successfully got matched into Ocean's Prime Level. So Prime Level comes with tons of benefits and perks, um, even though we didn't get any free play down here, but all the free fun stuff, it's enough to pay off for making the trip down here. So the most important thing down here was you get two free nights at the win with $50 credit for dining, which is amazing if you visit Vegas a lot, as well as um, seven night free cruise with MSC Cruise, it's completely complimentary, all you need to do is pay for the fees and all the convenience and all the taxes and stuff. But 7 night free cruise, I will take it. And there's a bunch of other freebies as well. We got 
a free t-shirt. I mean, this looks like you're working for the Ocean Casino, but I would I would take this any day. As well as uh, free parking, valet parking for Prime card holders. And I think this is really nice of them. They gave us um, the Avila Lounge access. So it's a one-time pass for two people. You can have lunch or dinner at the lounge right upstairs with amazing view of the ocean at the Ocean Casino. And then also two free calm nights in the Ocean's Casino itself. But you can't redeem it right away because it takes about 72 hours for that uh, benefit to you know, like show up in your account. So um, it's good for use for another you know, time to come back to Atlantic City. So even though we don't get any free play here, but so far overall, I say this is a win and really nice impression of the Ocean Casino itself. Good morning, it's bright and early and we're doing day two of our status matching in Atlantic City. We're making our next stop, which is the Live Casino in Philadelphia. The Live Casino in Philadelphia recently just opened last year and they're still doing status matching until the end of 2022. So even though it's an hour drive away, we are still going to head there and see what our Rock Royalty with Hard Rock is going to match us to. Alright, so we're our next stop at the Live Casino in Philadelphia. I'm taking my Rock Royalty card and walking to the Players Club. I'm gonna see what match we're gonna get. Let's go. Um, so I, I don't know if your uh, casinos offer any players match from other casinos. Uh, I'm Rock Royalty with uh, Heart Rock. Awesome. Do you guys do any match for that? Yeah. Are so you you're matching black. Black? Okay, yeah. awesome. We successfully matched into live black card. It is really cool because the black card with Live Casino has a partnership with Bahamar, 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 Bahamar Casino. So we get three calm nights over there. If we stack the both of us, that's six nights calm at a resort in the Caribbean. So super excited to enjoy these perks, and we also got forty-five dollar free play per person. So total of both of us, we got ninety dollar free play. Let's put that in the machine and hopefully turn out with some cash. <laughs> That's not bad. So we're our final stop at our Atlantic City status match runs. We're at the Bailey's Casino and Resort. This is actually a bonus round because recently we heard that Bailey's is no longer with Caesars. So apparently if you take your Caesars Diamond card, they might match you to one of the high tier status and hopefully matching the Caesars $100 celebratory dinner credits. So maybe we can get some free dining here. So let's take all these cards to the player's desk and check out and see if they can match us something fun. Let's go. After finding the rewards desk all the way at the back of the casino, I was able to successfully match my Caesars Diamond status to Bailey's Superstar status. Previously, Bailey's will only match and give free play or dining credit when you show emails of competing casinos from Atlantic City. However, during our visit, the desk agent was super strict and required to see actual physical mailers that had been sent to your address in order to match any offers. And he wouldn't match by seeing my email from Caesars. We walked away with only a paper status that is superstar level, as most of the perks that comes with these status, such as free trips to Bailey's Lake Tahoe and Wave Resort fees, are only offered to players that actually earn the status through gambling only. But we did get a scratch card offer as a new player with only $5 free play. So personally, Bailey's might be a skip on this tour when you are here in Atlantic City. Last but not least, we also tried asking the Resorts Casino and Golden Nugget if they're offering any sort of status matching promotion. But was only offered some accelerated status promotion and free play if we actually gamble a few thousand dollars within the next 24 hours of signing up with your player's card which in my opinion isn't worth the effort unless you plan on returning to these resorts to stay specifically. Wow, what a crazy run. With just one hotel status, we have successfully matched not only one, but six high tier level casino statuses. 
So I would say overall, our status matching tour in Atlantic City is a win. Even though some of the benefits are not as lucrative as it was before during the pandemic, but I would say for some perks such as the free night stays, in itself it's an amazing deal. For example, the three free nights in the Bahamar in the Bahamas, as well as the two free nights in the Wynn Las Vegas, Ocean's Casino Resort, and the Hard Rock Atlantic City. It's a really good deal. On top of that, with all this free play, it's just additional fun money to help you cover your costs during your trip here in Atlantic City. Last but not least, the seven free night cruise is the most lucrative deal out of the entire status matching trip. I personally have never been on a cruise before, so I would totally make this whole trip worth it again just for that free cruise. So to sum it all up, let us know what are your thoughts down in the comments below. If you like our video, make sure to leave a thumbs up as well as hit the subscribe button and ring the bell notification for more future videos like these. Till next time, this is Bernard.